been smoking in the woods since they came out. Turps in the air and they keep accumulating. Counting by the twos is how I'm numerating. Twisting the night away like I'm Sam Cook. Hoover's axe in the smoke. Thanks for rolling up. I'm Tuba Marley and this is Certified Piehead. You already know what I'm doing. I'm blazing up one of my uh, late night splits. It ain't really that late. It's mid evening, early nighttime splits. We about to be uh, jumping into another. We're gonna be jumping into another uh, cannabis conspiracy theory. Jumping into another cannabis conspiracy theory. This one is called the Loch Ness theory. So um, let's start off with a question. One that's been haunting Scottish folklore and stoner circles alike. What's long, green, and suspiciously elusive? If you said the Loch Ness Monster, then you're only about halfway right. What if instead of some legendary sea serpent, Nessie is actually just a really potent strain of weed? Don't dip yet. Stay, stay with me. Stay with me for a second. This could make this this could make sense. Maybe it don't make sense. Does it make sense? I don't know. I, I might I might be I might just be crazy. But we going we gonna walk it because if ancient people could mistake venus for a ufo couldn't modern day stoners mistake nessie for a cannabis plant i mean what's what's the, what's the harm in us just just this kickball and this, the, the thing around so we'll, we'll just kickball it around and see 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 where we see where we... all right picture this right deep under the Loch Ness's icy mysterious water grows a strain of weed so ancient so potent it only surfaces once in a while releasing spores that mess with the mind of anyone nearby they inhale this Nessie cushion. Boom. Suddenly, they're seeing a giant neck rising out of the water or maybe like like the back of something rising out of the water or just like ripples in the water. <laughs> then they think they're like, all right, hold on. What is that? Is that some type of some type of monster? I think people might be able to people might, might that might that might be possible. What do you think? Am I suggesting that people have been mistaken a weed plant for a prehistoric monster? Am I am I am I suggesting that I might I might be suggesting that. But if we can make you think that your refrigerator is singing and that you've seen a leprechaun, why couldn't it make you think that you've seen a monster in the water? How many people have hallucinated something on the extreme side of dank? Couldn't have been just me, right? Could it have been just me? No. Here's a riddle, though, to uh, distract you. What's so fragile that saying this name breaks it? Sit on that for a second. Stay with me though. The Loch Ness is deep, right? Cold and murky. The perfect hiding spot for a mystical mind altering plant. Maybe Nessie Kush had been growing undetected for centuries, happily chilling underneath the waves. Only surfacing occasionally to blow out some type of spores and shit. Then when people, you know what I mean, happen to walk by, <laughs> and then look over in the yonder and see what they think is a monster. That sounds kind of great. That sounds, that sounds. That sounds retarded. That sounds that sounds mentally not right. But he, he could be on to something right here. We could be on to something right now. We could be digging the, the ditch deep enough just to be striking gold. We might be. I could just be the stoner sitting out here with foil hat on. And what if what if the lock isn't the perfect hiding place? What if this whole thing is just another silly theory? Yeah, I'm 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 I'm, I'm, I'm reaching. I'm reaching. Let's let's move on. What can travel around the world while staying in the same corner? Well, Nessie is a weed strain, right? She got the best marketing team in history. Think about it, right? People have been talking about Nessie for centuries. And she doesn't even have a decent Instagram. <laughs> I just know Instagram account for the Loch Ness. At least I ain't seen it. How many modern weed strains can claim that kind of staying power? I mean, what, what are some weed strains that, that you now I mean are legendary? Acapulco Gold, Panama Red. Maybe that's the key, right? Maybe Nessie's a plant that got a legendary reputation like Purple Haze or Sour Diesel. But it's just way more mysterious. Instead of showing up in somebody's backyard, it's been growing underneath the lock. Only showing up every couple of decades to get keep people talking about it. Coming up just to not me spread spores, get people not me smoked out for just a couple minutes. If I start to sound crazy, bro. Oh, this this is reaching. This is a reach right here. But what if that's the idea, right? This a plant so hidden that even the idea of it just being there is so crazy it just might be true no, no, was it was it there's supposed to be a monster there's supposed to be a monster in this theory some, somewhere or maybe maybe the monster is the high right maybe when somebody say i seen the loch ness monster they're just talking about being high off of the loch ness weed what if what if that's what it is bro never mind bro here's another riddle right i'm taking from my mind shut up in a wooden case from which i am never released what am i all right maybe i've been too harsh on nessie right Maybe it's not a cannabis strain. What if it is an actual monster, right? I mean, I can't, I can't really shake the feeling that there's something else 
going on. I'm sure a prehistoric creature hiding out in Scotland's most famous lock is cool. That feels a little bit too easy, right? What if people have been getting high off of Nessie Kush for generations, seeing monsters where there aren't any? What if the real mystery isn't whether Nessie exists, but what kind of weed it is? Now I'm like sitting here thinking to myself, am I, am I doing backflips over this for nothing? Am I doing backflips over this for nothing? Do I really believe in this, or am I just throwing dank in the blunt trying to see if it's fire? I, I am smoking, so I am smoke. I am smoke right now, but is is this just the thoughts of a smoked out stoner? I don't know. Before I, before I dip, though, let me get you with one last riddle. The more you take, the more you leave behind. What am I? At the end of the day, right? Whether Nessie is a weed strain or a prehistoric creature, one thing's for sure, she got staying power. People have been fascinated by Nessie for generations and there's no sign that the fascination is stopping anytime soon maybe she's a monster maybe it's just a plant maybe it's both what if it is a monstery plant i don't know bruh but if Nessie is a weed strain that would explain a lot and if she's a monster then that's one of the greatest mysteries pretty fun to think about either way just just being high and free thinking about random shit the answer to the riddle silence a stamp pencil lead footsteps i'll see you on the next one bruh.